how to uh, customize and configure fonts, font colors, and line height. So, and I will jump right into the visual editor. Pretty easy to use, you don't have to do any coding. That's what's cool about it. In order to change fonts, there are a couple different ways you do it. Go into design, and really all you do on your site, which is kind of cool, you have this, basically it's an inspector. It will tell you exactly what you're looking at. So if I mouse over this navigation bar, you'll see, and if I click on it, it will open up, uh, you know, exactly what this is. So it's a navigation item. Uh, these are the colors right here. So I can actually change the colors of the font right here. I'm not going to do that right now, but you can do it that way. You can also change the background. So the background behind these is a specific color. And then you can also change the right border. Uh, I don't have a border showing. Basically, I just it, made it the same color as the background so it wouldn't show because I didn't want to have that little line between the fonts. You know, just a personal thing. So the other thing is you'll notice if you look at these links right here, the line height is kind of weird. It's all mashed up. All right. So what I did by mistake is I picked a specific size font. All right. But I forgot to check the line height. It's at actually at 15. All right. So if I select that right here, it should fix the problem. Okay. And I can make that line height even bigger. So I could say line height, you know, 21 for the navigation bar. That way it gives you a lot of, a lot of space right here. Uh, and then also the fonts you can easily change. And again, as you're changing these, it's making the changes visually so you can see what things look like. Like I'm just kind of clicking back and forth, different fonts, just seeing what I like. Uh, and then you can, in the, uh, in, in all the fonts actually, you can do a bold, you can bold it, okay? And you can also do small caps, all right? Text transformation, you can do uppercase or lowercase. That will change the whole uh, font to be lowercase. Basically, these are all created in WordPress pages. Okay, I don't have to go back to the title of that page and change it. You can just do it all right in here. Okay, uh, If you pick none, it's just going to go with the default, which is what I have right here. Uh, so obviously, I'm not you know, a designer. I'm just kind of going by the look and feel, which is one thing I like about Headway. Not really stated too much out there, you know, people talking about headway, that this is really a theme for people who aren't designers, okay? It's actually, you know, a theme for people who are designers too, right? But for the non-designer, what's cool about it is that basically you can play around with it until you find something you like. Sun. 